Today I'll be showing you how to install Microsoft Teams on Ubuntu 20.04 Linux. So open up your favorite web browser and head over to this website which will be linked in the description below and you can see that the title is Microsoft Teams is now available on Linux. Starting today Microsoft Teams is available for Linux users in public preview enabling high quality collaboration experiences for the open source community at work and in educational institutions. Users can download the native Linux packages in .deb and RPM formats here. So let's click on this here hyperlink and you can click the download for desktop button as we are on desktop. So it will bring you to this website which says download teams for work on your desktop. So we will be installing the DEB package which stands for Debian. So let's click that and let's wait for it to download. Save file. Okay. Once it has downloaded, let's click this button which will open the containing folder. So you can see that it's in the downloads directory. So now open up your terminal. You can do this by hitting Ctrl Alt T on your keyboard. And type in CD downloads or wherever you downloaded it. So ls you can see that we have the dev file right here so to now install this package all you need to write is sudo dpkg hyphen i and then type in teams and you can press tab to auto complete and hit enter type in your sudo password and the installation should begin So you can see that it has downloaded setting up teams and it's done processing the triggers. So now we can clear and if you hit your super key which is most likely your windows key. You can search for teams and it will bring you this icon of Microsoft Teams saying Microsoft Teams. So now you can click it to open it. Give it a few moments to open for the first time as it needs to mount certain things in your hard drive. So you can see I have a splash screen that shows here. And it will do this every time you open up a Teams instance. When booting in for the first time, it may ask you for a login for your email and password. So you can see that we are logged in properly and we can access all the things that you can do online or on the Windows operating system. So there's the teams right here. You can click on your name to go into settings right here settings and you can change to dark theme or light theme and you also have the chat there's assignments there's also the calendar there's basically everything that a normal Microsoft Teams would have so that is really nice and when you close it it doesn't close fully it closes to the tray so if you really want to quit, you have to click this icon up here and click on quit. And if this icon doesn't show, make sure your app indicator extension, app indicators, Ubuntu app indicator is enabled, which, which will let you see this. So if I turn it off, you will see it disappear. 
so you can see that you can't see the teams but now if I open it again or enable it it is showing now so that is about it for teams now I'll show you how to remove it so what you want to do is open up the terminal again and all you need to write is sudo apt apt remove teams that's it and hit enter type in your sudo password and it should be removed I will not be removing it as I will need it for future use and my classes so thank you for watching that is about it